Hi there, football fans. Welcome to Goalside. Before we start, don't forget to participate in our lottery for a chance to win a $100 Amazon gift card. All you have to do is like this video, subscribe to our channel, and write the hidden message you'll find later in the video in the comments. Good luck. Erling Holland is the brightest young hope of European football. The striker has it all. He's tall, but extremely fast. He's technically gifted, but also finds spaces without the ball perfectly. Overall, he looks like the next big thing, and there isn't any seeing what could get in his way, but Kylian Mbappe and company disagree. After beating Borussia Dortmund in the away leg of the Champions League, Paris Saint-Germain's players were ecstatic. In fact, they went so far to provoke Holland by imitating his celebration after the match multiple times, with Neymar and Mbappe starring in the biggest roles. But why is that? Well, for starters, Holland scored a brace in the first leg, completely crushing PSG in a 2-1 win, as the public was all over the Parisians because the superstars such as Neymar, Mbappe, Di Maria and Cavani were beaten by a 19-year-old Norwegian sensation. The media played up the part fully. They filled the headlines claiming that Holland is actually a bigger talent than the World Cup winner Kylian Mbappe. This definitely didn't sit well with a star-studded and ego-filled dressing room such as in PSG and they wanted their revenge. However, more than Haaland's harmless celebration, perhaps the PSG stars felt threatened after the first leg. Both Neymar and Mbappe are primed to be the best in the world as Lionel Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo are approaching the twilight of their careers. And now, this kid with his teammate Jadon Sancho came out of nowhere to take over the crown. It seemed as if the public fully embraced Haaland too. He's quick thinking, witty in his interviews, winning over the crowds left, right and centre. His response to scoring a hat-trick earlier this season is already a thing of legend. I have five hat-trick balls in my bed and I sleep well with them. They are my girlfriends. Not only is he smart, but he's also a footballing machine. Working with his father, who was also a professional footballer since the age of 10, made an impact on the young Norwegian who knows the ins and outs of football, and a bunch of private coaches trained him to perfection, as he already looks like he's ready to take over the world. On the other hand, the PSG stars are on a downward spiral when it comes to media perception. Even though there's probably no doubt that Neymar is the biggest talent on the planet since Lionel Messi, the Brazilian isn't living up to the expectations. Often trips to Brazil, problems with the management, wanting to leave Paris, all of this affected Neymar's public image that has now been damaged and his behaviour on the pitch isn't helping either. The Brazilian magician often takes it a step too far, provoking the opponent without any specific reasons leading to them kicking Neymar more than they should, which in turn results in numerous injuries. On the other hand, after being touted as the golden boy of European football, perhaps for the first time in his career, Kylian Mbappe is facing some heavy critics. They aren't coming without a reason either. The French star was seen dismissing his manager, Thomas Tuchel, a couple of occasions, completely ignoring his authority and doing things on his own will. It seems as his behaviour on the pitch changed, similarly too to Neymar, Mbappe is starting to play on his own more and more as the time goes by, ignoring the teamwork. Obviously it sometimes leads to moments of brilliance such as in the first leg of the Dortmund clash, but it often hurts the team in the long run as the teammates don't trust each other quite as much as they should to make results. However, it's not all just black and white. While all of this is going on, it's easy to forget just how good the PSG duo are. On the other hand, Holland, as much as he's ultra-talented and fun to watch, is still new in the world of elite football, and PSG just knocked Dortmund out of the Champions League. But the good thing for fans worldwide is that this rivalry is heating up. Some of the most talented players on the planet going in these clashes with an extra motive should provide us with a decade of epic matchups, where the superstars exchange positions at the top. Still, the players will probably mature themselves too just like Edinson Cavani and Keylor Navas, who didn't want to have anything with mocking Holland after the Champions League win. The younger superstars will hopefully have their ego taken down to earth as the time goes by. Whatever the case may be, we'll enjoy watching these players go all out in years to come in the biggest competition. Who knows, they may even join forces one day, especially as PSG has a reputation for always going for the best player the market has to offer. With Holland's 70 million euro release clause, it's easy to see the Parisians exercising this option, although it's unlikely that the Norwegian will want to go to Ligue 1 so early in his career, as the more competitive leagues are waiting to be conquered.